Hi, this is Charlie from Path of the Bee. In this video, I'm going to show you how I assemble bee boxes. Okay, so I start out by having the top of the handle away from me, and then I can install my, uh, my side boards in. The boxes that I make fit together very, very tightly. So I use a dead blow hammer, something that won't damage the wood, and I tap it together. When I'm doing that, I want to make certain that um, I, I'm not overlapping anything here, and there's room to assemble it later. Same thing on this side. We're just going to get it started with the dead blow hammer. And then top of the handle away from me. Get one side going first. Once it's started, we'll get this side started. Okay. Before we start putting nails in the pre-drilled holes, we want to check and make sure that we're square. So I put this on here, I could tell I'm not square. Before I have a bunch of nails in it, I could still rack this pretty easily to get it squared up. Now that it's square, I'm going to go ahead and start nailing it. After every few nails, um, I'll check for square again so I can keep it, keep it square. Another method I use for square is this jig that I built. It's a piece of three-quarter plywood that's cut a sixteenth of an inch smaller than the inside diameter of the finished box. And then just a lip on it uh, that's slightly smaller than the outside dimension of the finished box. So I can fit it in tight. Now I know that the box is square and I can nail at, free, at, at will. I use a six penny box nail. I find that it works very well for me. Um, if you can get them galvanized, that's the preferred nail. And yes, we do use a full-size nail in the little thin piece. Okay, there you have it. A completed bee box. Okay, so there you go. If you have questions or comments, please leave them below. I hope you enjoyed.